and welcome back to another video or welcome if you're new here. Today's video, as I would suggest, is a Zara haul. Um, it's, I wouldn't say it's particularly like a really, really autumnal haul, um, but it does have some boots, so I guess that bit is, is autumnal, but generally I think it's a bit of a transition haul um, because it's all things I've seen on the website this month, which is September. So anyway, I'm going to get straight into the pieces and I'm going to show you the pieces on and how I intend to wear the pieces. Some of them will be styled together and some of them will be styled with pieces I already have in my wardrobe. Um, but everything I show, I will link in the description box below. So I hope you like it and enjoy. Okay, so the first piece is this oversized knit waistcoat. Now I actually got this um, after seeing it like all over Instagram and Lots of people have been seen, I've seen wearing it. I've actually done it with nothing underneath and that's how I intended to wear it. However, when I come, um, it, it's actually really quite low. So I've, I don't know how, how they've got away with it really. Um, so I've had to just throw on a little, a little vest top um, underneath. I think maybe if you had like a nude like um, bralette or something like that, you could probably get away with it. Um, I didn't have one for, for the clip, so I've just threw on this little vest top. Um, but I still do really like it. Um, I think the idea is just to wear it like casual. It actually does come with a matching skirt. Um, I did know that, but you can get a matching skirt as well. Um, but I just I had an idea to have it over like wide leg trousers or um, jeans. As you can see in this clip now, um, I've got it over some wide leg um, trousers from Uniqlo. Um, uh, I like it like that as well. I've actually done it on this one with nothing underneath, um, but I've had to wear like a crossbody bag just to try and keep it like secure to my body. And I wouldn't intend to wear it open, but I thought I'll just give you, show you a little clip of it open in case that's how you intend to wear it. Um, yeah, so you've got closed or open option. Um, and I think it does look nice both ways, but personally, I'd do it closed. The next item up is the split, le split hem leggings. And the reason why I got these is because I thought it'd be like an, a bit of an elevated basic. Um, I thought that maybe I could wear them, you know, like in the day casually with flip flops um, or trainers and then style them with like up a little bit of a night. However, they are quite long. So you'll see on the clip here that I'm actually five foot seven and you can see I'm wearing them with about a four inch heel. Um, and you can see where they touch on me. So I don't know whether I'd be able to get away with them really with flats. I think they would just pull too much on the floor really. So I'd say maybe if you're like any 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 height below five, seven, you're probably gonna have to wear them with a heel. Um, so I was a little bit surprised when I got them that they were that long. However, once putting them on, I realized that I actually quite like them as a bit more of a dressed up piece. You know, like a change of like, either instead of wearing like a leather legging or a black jean when you're going out i think it'd be a nice little change up and this next piece was just a cropped um sleeveless knit this one i actually think i will be sending back because it's quite a chunky knit and i think for me it just doesn't really work because it is very cropped and because i've got a fuller bust i think it just adds extra um weight to that area so i think where i'm already top heavy i think it just increases that because of the the knit being quite thick however i do think it is lovely um so maybe if you've got a smaller bust i think it would look uh, really lovely um but just keep in mind it is quite a thick knit uh, and i've just again done it with some jeans and then with some the same uniqlo wide leg trousers um, i think it looks nice um, both all black or black and jeans um yeah, and the next item is these cotton trousers. Now, these are definitely going back. When I got them out of the bag, I had absolutely no clue what they were, and I, I was like, I don't even remember ordering these. However, I looked on my order and I've realized um, they look quite different on the website. Like, I was not expecting them to be this, like, really thin, like, cotton jersey. Like, um, they are cotton, but, like, I can't really explain, but they're kind of, like, in between a tracksuit and a pajama bottom they feel like and also i got them in a size that's too big hence why they're baggy on me but they will be going back and um, this next one is just this basic little knit and uh, it's like a sleeveless cardigan with a button up um but i bought it bought it with the intention of wearing it as a top um 
So I just thought it'd be just a simple one, like you know, to throw on with jeans, with trousers, with skirts, but make it just a, look a little bit more elevated because of the girl buttons. Again, I'd say this was like another, another elevated basic. Um, and I like it stars underneath as well because it looks like it might be a long sleeve um, cardigan. However, you don't have like the bulkiness of um, the bulkiness or the heat of the sleeve. And of course, I live in Hong Kong, so it's perfect <laughs> for here. Um, and yeah, I've, put, I've thrown it on with this bash skirt, and I like that look as well. For a bit more um, of like a elevated day look, or you could get away with throwing a pair of heels on wherever night. So I think it just this is just coming super handy um, for a day or night look. Okay, so this next item is these leather chunky boot, ankle boots. Now, as you will know, you will be seeing these all over um, the high street and designers as well and okay they're not the most <laughs> feminine boots i don't think they're going to be something that um my husband will love but i actually really really love them these ones are about 80 pounds which isn't cheap but if you were looking for a little bit of a cheaper alternative i have seen very very similar ones in h&m but these i think are just going to go great for the autumn and into the winter okay and that was all the pieces that i have for you today i hope you liked seeing the pieces on and seeing how i intend to wear them in the future and yeah, if you did like this video, I'd be so happy if you give it in a thumbs up and um, so hit the like button and I'd be over the moon if you subscribe to my channel. I'll also link my Instagram in the description box below. So um, if you want to see how I wear these items day to day, um, head over there and give me a follow there too. So thank you so much again for watching and I hope I'll see you again in my next video. So thank you. Bye bye.